guys, what is going on? Welcome back to Empty Paradise's Cars and Collectibles. So today's video, we actually have something that's a little bit older, and I just recently got it in. I thought it was pretty cool, so I decided to make a video on it. And it's actually a Hot Wheels uh, Nightburners 5-pack. So this 5-pack isn't just any ordinary 5-pack. It has one special car that everybody's really excited about, and that right there is the Nissan Skyline GTR, the R32. And it also has the uh, Dashes, the Chrysler 300C Hemi, the Volkswagen New Beetle Cup and Pony Up. So we're gonna go ahead and bust open all of these cars and we're gonna pull that out. And I do wanna do like a race with all of these. So we're gonna take all five of these, line them up on the Hot Wheels six lane raceway. We're gonna race them and see which one is the fastest. And I'm actually really hoping for the Nissan Skyline to win that race. But let's go ahead and open these up and check them out. So while I am opening this, I do want to mention that I do have a merch store. So I have a bunch of Hot Wheels on there as well as some other car related products. And if you guys do go on there, I am doing giveaways like every single month with Hot Wheel cars that are pretty awesome, even some Hot Wheel RLC. Previously I did a Lego Nissan Skyline GTR, so definitely go check it out. Link in the description down below, you guys hop on there. I have Hot Wheel Mainline Premium RLC, a bunch of other cars, so you do not want to miss out. Uh, I do want to point out this one I did get super cheap. I did kind of forget to mention it was creased this whole top piece. There's some damage on the back, but also the uh, the plastic is a bit mangled here. So that was already cracked and you can kind of see it inside the package. So it might have actually come from the factory damage because it was still sealed inside this box. But let's go ahead and pull out the Volkswagen Beetle first, which I think this actually looks really, really cool. And boom, there it is. It has a really cool design on the side, that green interior, and it, since it's the cup car, it does have a roll cage inside, which you can kind of see through that back window. Big duckbill spoiler on the back, and I think that's pretty crazy. Next up, we have, which one is this? The Audacious, and I think it looks kind of interesting. It's like a little, a little wagon. It's one of those like generic kind of fantasy cars, so... Not super sought after, but I think they actually did a pretty good job with it. And even the tires on that are the, uh, I forgot what they call it, like the faster tires with them being kind of open and everything. So we'll see if that helps it. And then we have the Pony Up, which is kind of an interesting proportions. It almost looks like it was kind of based on the Viper with that wide front end, then it kind of tapers in, and then it gets wider again at the rear. But I think that's kind of interesting. Another generic car. And, and then we have the Chrysler 300C, which actually it's a plastic body with a metal base. So there it is right there. Has some cool flames down the side. There's that iconic kind of Chrysler grill there. And then that's it right there. And then you see like that whole metal bottom. So it's kind of interesting that it's set up like that. But the one car that I got this for is this one right here and it actually looks really good and that's the nissan skyline gtr the r32 and wow and another little detail i just noticed is it does have a missing headlights and it has the intake there instead so i really love that little detail that hot wheels added into that but i think this car looks absolutely amazing it has that big wing on the back and it's all part of the die cast and man that car looks so so good let me know down in the comments down below what you guys think of that. Even the back end is super detailed. I love all of that. Even it has the Nissan Skyline and the little GTR logo. The taillights are colored. And man, this is an awesome car, especially for a five pack. That thing looks really, really good. And I'll be able to add this to my huge collection of JDM cars right here on this wall. I have a whole nother wall across the backdrop of my Hot Wheels 6 Lane Raceway. And every single day I do Hot Wheel races. So definitely hit that subscribe button because uh, those races are in the form of YouTube shorts. And like I said, every single day I have one go live. I do weekly tournaments and those are really fun. But I'll be able to add these cars to that. But let's go ahead, take all these cars right now, line them up on the 6 Lane Raceway, race them and see which one is the fastest. All right, so we have all five of the cars lined up right here on the six lane raceway. And honestly, that GTR looks super, super good. Let me know down in the comments down below which one is your guys' favorite out of all five of these. Which one do you think is going to win this race? But let's go ahead, race them, and find out who's the winner in three, two, one. Wow, I honestly did not expect that, but the Chrysler 300 is actually the fastest car from those. Honestly, I did not expect that to be the winner, but that's pretty crazy. 
All right, so there you have it. The Chrysler 300 was the winner of that race. Like I said before, I honestly did not expect that at all. I was actually really hoping for the Nissan Skyline. But at the end of the day, this is still my favorite car from this entire five pack. Let me know what you guys think of this down below in the comments. Uh, also, do you guys have this five pack or did you guys pick it up when it came out? Also, I have no idea when this came out. So if you guys could, if you do know, let me know. I'm kind of curious about that because it's not a brand new set. It's a little bit older, but I think that's actually having that skyline in this set is a pretty awesome thing. But, but if you guys did like the video, definitely get on, hit that like button, subscribe if you want to see more videos like this and a bunch of other Hot Wheel videos with case unboxings, Hot Wheel racing, and a bunch of other cool stuff. But like, subscribe, and as always, thank you for watching.